Adrian Charles can't believe they've given us this one. How to make Adrian Charles relevant again? W was he ever relevant? I don't know if he ever was. Um, but what is Adrian Charles? It's, it's like a load of meat that's been smashed into the shape of a man by a blind sculptor with a dull chisel. I mean, Adrian's a really good friend of mine, actually. Um, um, well, I say friend. He's um, he's a bit of a drinking partner. I see him in Shoreditch House sometimes. And he, he comes in. He's with his wife. It, is it more of a fact that you drink when you see Adrian Charles? I can't tell if it's. I drink when I see Adrian Charles, or when I drink, I see Adrian Charles. I think the problem is, people are never going to like Adrian Charles. There's nothing to draw people in. Well, we could always just kill Adrian Charles, and then he'd be in the news. That's true. It's a very short-term solution, but uh, I mean, people like dead people more than live people, don't they? They will remember the good times of Adrian Charles, or perhaps manufacture some. Would anybody tell if Adrian Charles was dead? It's got to be something else. There's got to be something extra. Because you're right, nobody's going to give a shit, to be mm. honest. Perhaps somebody else has to go with him. Uh, okay, fine. It's an unpleasant thought, but I don't think people will mind giving their lives if they know that their deaths will go towards the death of Adrian Charles. Yeah, if they knew they were doing a good, it's like, you know, it's, would you give your life to... Um, to have got rid of, say, Adolf Hitler mm. just a little bit earlier. And I think a lot of people would say, you know what? I bloody well would have, because yeah. he, you know, he was doing all sorts of you know, crazy stuff that should never have happened. Mm. So. Like uh, Daybreak. Daybreak, yeah. So Adrian Charles, Alan Titchmarsh, Ooh. and Greg Dyke are all in a Land Rover, and they accidentally missteer the car into a canal in Kent. All of them die. Yeah, we'd get some headlines with Titchmarsh. I'm not sure about the others, really. Well, you know what? That's good enough. If we could get it on the front page, it's fine. Titchmarsh dies in canal disaster. Adrian Charles is also in the car. No? That's okay. We'll leave that one. I mean, we've got Lisa Riley. She's on our way out. That's not bad at all. Lisa Riley and Adrian Charles were playing that game where you jump from a cupboard onto a bed. What's that called? Uh, idiocy. Idiocy. Yeah, they're, they're being idiots in a hotel room. They're jumping around, they're throwing things about, they're getting carried away, they've had way too much to drink. They're both married, what are they doing there? Next thing you know, Adrian Charles is lying on the bed, completely naked. Lisa Riley is on top of the TV cabinet. Adrian says, just, just do it. And she jumps right off this cupboard, goes through the bed, through the floor. We have a kind of World Trade Center situation with the building crumbling to the ground. And, um, you know, thousands of people are killed. Um, I think Lisa Riley would probably go along with it. She has been very depressed uh, since meeting Adrian Charles. Mm. Anyway, we'll tell him that, you know, we're going to make him relevant. It's just going to take a little bit of sacrifice. Yeah, get rid of him. Brilliant. So, badminton? Golf. Golf.